Hi guys, Alex here from Drayton's. Here we've got a Volkswagen Passat 2 litre TDI SE Business DSG, finished in manganese grey metallic paint. All the wheels and tyres are in very good condition. These are 17 inch London alloy wheels. At the back, you get a nice large boot and those back seats will fold down if you need any extra space in there. The central seat will also fold down individually to give you some through loading and the uh, boot floor itself is a variable boot floor so it will drop down slightly to give you some extra depth as well. You do also have this storage on either side as well. And also release the back seats from the boot area as well so you don't have to walk around to release them from the doors. This has got MOT until the 12th of the 12th 2022 and we'll come with a full VW service history. Inside we have the Kensington Cloth Titan Black seats, uh, nice and comfortable, uh, fairly supportive as well, they're easy to uh, travel in um, and they're decent bolsters on the side and the base to keep you in place as well. That continues to the rear with the exception of the central seat which is slightly different material, uh, but all in all very very comfortable. Up front we have your rev counter on the left, your speedo on the right and digital screen in the centre. Currently showing the digital speedo but there's also various different things you can scroll through including your fuel range, average speed, average MPG, things like that. We've also got various different tabs on the side as well so you've got your assist systems which will just turn the adaptive cruise control on so that actually shows. Um, so you can change the range and things of the um, average, uh, sorry adaptive cruise control. Uh, moving to the side you've got nav tab, uh, your audio whether that be radio or media, your telephone so you can make calls from your recent contacts, your vehicle status and back to your driving data as well. Moving down here we've got a touchscreen system, um, two dials either side, you've got your volume and um, a scroller as well for certain screens. Uh, so we've got your radio, you've got DAB, FM, AM radio. Also got your media tab with Bluetooth, uh, aux input, um, various other things you've got a cd player located in the glove box as well and usb is just down there um, that you can use for your media you can also use it for the app connect so we've got android auto apple carplay and mirror link so you can have your own phone screen on the screen in the car if you prefer just to have your calls and your music coming through then you can just do that via bluetooth so you've got hands free and your bluetooth music streaming as well uh, got your vehicle settings on here as well, so you've got various different screens you can have. Um, convenience, consumers, sport mode as well. Um, various different settings you can have on here as well, um, including your parking and manoeuvring, driver assistance settings, and your service settings as well. We've got built in sat nav, uh, closed sat nav system, nice, easy to use, uh, nicely up to date as well. You can change the points of interest and things like that, um, so you can have less or more showing. Um, this is one of the screens where the uh, scroller. Uh, is uh, used on the right hand side so you can change the distance and you've also got various different views from 2D, 3D, auto, uh, things like that as well. you also got live traffic updates with the nav as well so it will show um, any traffic or accidents or anything in your area moving further out as well to further afield so if you have gone on longer journeys then you do have that on there too and then we've got a few more tabs on the other side including your sound uh, and your images setting which you don't, re don't really use. We've got park pilot so you've got front and rear sensors with the selective display that will come, come on automatically when you put the car into reverse but you can turn it on and off just using the P button there. Down here we've got um, a three zone climate control system so you've got uh, temperature for the driver, temperature for the passenger and a temperature for the rear as well. You can sync them all up as they are now so when you change the driver the passenger and the rear will change as well or you can have them all individually. You also get heated front seats which in winter are very very useful as I'm sure you may know um, but it's nice to have the, the heated front seats because not all come with those. Down here is the USB port which I mentioned earlier which you will need to use for your Apple CarPlay or Android Auto. We've got a DSG gearbox so you've got standard drive mode and you've also got a sporty setup for the gearbox which will uh, let it rev more freely so you can uh, optimise the rev range and optimise for performance rather than efficiency which is what the standard drive mode does. 
got your engine start stop down here as well and your drive modes so you've got eco normal sport and individual on individual you can change certain things to suit your preference if you want the driving sport you can have if you want the steering your sport you can have um, so it's quite um, easy to personalize as well we have an electronic parking brake and a hill hold assist as well as a couple of cup holders and a 12 volt socket here as well a little place down here I just use that for the key because it's really all you can fit in that little storage area there uh, we've got some space in the centre console here as well as a USB and an aux input as well storage is pretty good so you've got uh, side pockets in the um, doors front and rear uh, they're lined with felt as well so if you've got stuff in there they don't rattle around too much uh, as is the central console and also the glove box uh, we've got a nice um, sporty styled steering wheel, you've got a flat bottom on it, nice um, leather steering wheel, it's not too big, not too small, so you do get a nice grip on it. Um, on the left hand side you've got your adaptive cruise control, so you can increase the range with that, um, as you can see there, and then increase the speed and things like that. You've also got an assist systems button there, which brings you to this screen, so you can either have adaptive cruise control or your speed limiter on, um, and then you can turn front assist on and off. Got your volume controls and the uh, multifunction controls for the screen in front on the right hand side as well as the track skip or radio skip we have flappy paddles if you if you prefer a manual sporty style of driving uh, rain sensing wipers automatic lights and heated and electrically adjustable wing mirrors with electric fold as well on the driver's seat you do get um, ergo comfort so you've got an electronic um, backrest and you've also got lumbar support here as well moving to the back as I mentioned you've got still got the cloth in the rear and your temperature control in the back as well and I do believe you have a 12 volt socket yep you do 12 volt socket in the back just under there um, and then we have a central armrest with some cup holders and you've also got the through loading which I mentioned earlier if you want to use that for longer items it's got some storage behind the seats as well as uh, door pockets in the back as well they're a decent size so you can fit a bottle in there uh, quite easily really nice car um, very easy to drive uh, very easy to live with and you do have a lot of space as well um, good space in the rear seats good space in the boot and also you've got roof bars if you want to uh, stick a roof box on there for some more storage as well it will come with six months gold cover warranty which can be extended for as little as £199 for an extra six months we also have a range of finance options available so if finance is something you're looking for then we can help you out with that as well if you need any more information on this car or any of the cars we have in stock please go to drayton's.co.uk thank you